Hey, this is Chris from Record Talk. That's what the C stands for. It's my merch. And what I'm really doing here is I'm entering a contest. Contest starts with C for Sam St. John, who doesn't start with C. So Sam St. John's throwing a contest, and so he gave us some prompts, and let's go ahead and answer his prompts. First one is he wants us to show our favorite box set. There we are, the story of Zamrock, one of these Vinyl Me Please anthologies, and it's got a total of eight records in it. Let's take a look at them. We've got we've got the nice booklet. So I'm I'm fumbling around here, but of course you've got like features on all the different albums and write-ups about them. And let me just I made a video about this box set at some point, and maybe I'll link it up at the end. So we have the witch introduction we have Amanaz Africa which I think is one of the best uh, Zamrock albums one album Wonder Band in Gazi Family I love in Gazi Family Danger 45,000 volts so you got Paul and Gazi and Chrissy Zebi Tembo in that band um, we've got Ricky Banda Ricky Bonda's Wonderful, Who's That Guy, what a great song that is. I think that was on the Zamrock compilation. We've got Wise Man by Crossbones. We've got Dots with Fireballs. I mean, just look at those pants. Look at the flares on those. Uh, we've got Five Revolutions, I'm a Free Man. And finally, we've got the oscillations. I can see it coming. This is super, super fuzzy. It's all very fuzzy, garagey, uh, funky, because it's Zamrock. All right. Uh, show an album by an artist you've seen live. Well, I haven't seen any of the Zamrock people live. I've seen Pearl Jam live, and yes, I did a gatefold and I'm not taking it out of the fancy gatefold the lightning bolt album from 2013 I'm showing this because it's one of the pearl jams I have on vinyl also happens to be the tour uh, that I saw them on and so you see they've got like these uh, little things for all the songs it's, it's definitely not their best album but uh, it looks cool uh, show a sealed album all right, let's show you a sealed album. And so this is a Holly Dolly Christmas on the exclusive transparent white vinyl at Walmart that I actually didn't buy at Walmart. It's still sealed. And I know this is going to be gauche, but on my channel on December 15th, I'm going to do an unsealing of this one year old, a Holly Dolly Christmas that I bought. So you should go watch my channel for that. Yes, I'm advertising my own channel during Sam St. John's contest. You should watch his videos as well. Show an album you've only heard once. All right, well, this is something that I just kind of randomly got recently. Stone Jack Jones with the album Black Snake. And this came out in 2019 on YK Records. And if you're asking who is Stone Jack Jones, well, I was wondering the same thing. I had ordered... A couple of the albums by the band Forget Cassettes, which was a great indie rock band from Nashville, fronted by Beth Cameron in like the 2000s and early 2010s. And they, had re they were reissuing a their albums. And so I bought them and the company threw in um, an extra album. Um, and this is the album they gave me. And so far I've spun it once. It's kind of indie folk, not too bad. I should probably listen to it again after I'm done with this video. Show an autograph or an item you would like to have autographed. Well, this is sort of an accidental autograph. Uh, so it's on a CD. So this is uh, Centrido, uh, Lubicor, uh, Lou Barlow. 
And so, of course, this is Lou Barlow from Sebado and Dinosaur Jr. and all of that. And so this was basically a CD compilation of some songs that I think he had been posting online uh, that I bought uh, directly from him. And I actually didn't ask him to do this, but he, as you see, he said, thanks for ordering my shit, Chris. Lou B, August 2002. So thank you, Lou Barlow. And thank you, Sam St. John. 